So Tasha's dad has responded to Jax and that video and he is not pleased. Hey guys, it's Marab Morali. Hopefully you guys are all doing well today. Back at it again with another video. If you have not subscribed, click that button guys. It is daily and consistent content. Consistent and persistent baby injected. I am doing a reunion live streaming guys via Zoom. If you guys want to check it out, the link is in the bio below and in the pinned comment. Tickets are selling like hotcakes. They are nearly gone. So, you know, it's about to be a lit reunion, I hope. And you guys can watch with me, watch the TV. We can play some music and I'm going to talk to you guys after it as well, giving you guys my undivided attention this time. And it's just going to be me and you guys. The link is in the bio below and in the pinned comment. Come through guys. And let's have a moment. Anyway, let's get into this video where Tasha's dad has responded defending Tasha, as he, sh you know, as he should, where he is responding saying, some people grow and mature from their Love Island experience, some of them don't. It is what it is. Basically referencing to the fact that Jax has not matured from his, from his experience, hasn't learned much. And I do think that, you know, there could be points to what Tasha's dad is saying because somebody like him was very emotional as he was about to leave the villa. It was all too much for him and then he left. And now he's become like, you know, this kind of spokesperson for ADHD, you know, when having doing interviews. Um, but then it looks like he's back to his old ways in these, you know, Instagram stories. The way he's speaking of Tasha was very similar to how he spoke to some of the contestants in the villa. I just do think he has a lot of growing up to do. He's a 23 year old old you know boy and I do think that you know maybe by the time he's 30 maybe he will change maybe he won't but I do think that people are more lenient on him than they would be with the likes of Dami for example or the likes of um I don't know who else comes to mind but I do think people have become you know leaning on him purely because I guess they just got a lot for him and everybody had sympathy for him before he left the villa and he was seen crying everybody felt sorry for him and you know they thought you know what the guy's done bad but his mental health is at stake here let's just leave it but then to see stuff like this which is basically sim remind people of the old Jack I don't think Jack has really changed anyways from from when he stepped in the villa to now I don't think there's a really a big difference um only our perception of him is changes so I'm glad that Tasha's dad is you know taking a stance because Tasha herself doesn't choose to respond even in the villa she always che um, always chose to just you know not really respond or give back the same energy um, that Luca and um, Jax she always chose not to give back the same energy um, in that regard uh, so for her dad to speak out and kind of come with some energy and think that you know he's not mature I think is a good thing I don't think he'll speak about the video he wasn't at the reunion either I don't know if he was banned from the reunion because apparently he is in London so you know he was around for it but yet he wasn't there he doesn't even live in London so why are you here unless he's got other endeavours it is interesting that maybe the Love Island just did not want him there but you know I do expect it's going to be a juicy reunion and I can't wait for it let me know your thoughts are, guys, when it comes to this quick Love Island Nuggets. There's so many of these Love Island Nuggets guys flying around. Just trying to get them all into a video. Yesterday I was very ill, so unfortunately I was unable to be daily and consistent, but here I am today, thankfully. Subscribe to the channel, click that button. It is daily and consistent content, and I'll catch you guys soon.